Hello, you lovely ladies and gentlemen. Uh, welcome uh, to another Advanced Wars online PvP stream uh, where I will play against you guys. Sorry for the lateness. Uh, I just got home and then I realized I forgot to respond to about 50 friend requests. And uh, if you know anything about friend requests and the Switch, it takes forever. It's horrible. So yeah, I've been out walking. It's beautiful weather outside in Norway right now. I can walk outside in a t-shirt. I was listening to uh, Wheel of Time audiobook. My girlfriend's been bugging me for practically years to uh, finally read the Wheel of Time. And I was like, okay. So I got, I got the audiobook for it. And I've been listening to it as I've been out walking. And uh, it's been a beautiful day. Has gotten... Uh, it's not cold, it was uh, 17 degrees Celsius outside today. That's very warm by Norwegian standards, extremely warm. It's not reading, it's... Shut up, I like audiobooks, they're great. Allows me to walk and read at the same time. Manx, can, can, can I fight you? I'm around 900... Oh, hi there, Multitopic Talk. I remember you. Um, however, Multitopic Talk, I have a bit of a slap on the wrist for you. Last time we fought on my stream, you stream sniped me. You were listening to me in a fog of war match and you admitted it in chat. That rubbed me the wrong way. Don't do that if you're gonna fight me again. If we're playing a fog of war match, that is. If we're playing standard, you can. So, um. Uh, yeah, I remember being like, what? This guy's listening to what I'm doing? Yeah, calling you out. You got called out by the egg. Um, but, 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 it's not like I can really control it anyway. Mm -mm. <laughs> he was listening to the Manx audiobook. <laughs> yes, you were listening. That's not allowed. It was a fog of war match. I was talking about like building battlecopters and you were listening. So you knew the, you had an empire ready for me when the battlecopter. Cheater. Okay. All right. He's a content creator, he can handle it. It's okay, it's okay. Alright, so... Anyway, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go have a look at some maps. So we're gonna go to design the room. Yeah, tainted, exactly. Does my lightning look weird today? It might be my shirt, I don't know, like, is it... Maybe it'll look better without the... Maybe it'll look better without the light? Maybe? Looks a little bit better, I think. Yeah, I think the lightning in my room is a bit whack today. Yeah. I think that looks better, don't you guys think? That looks a little better, right? A little bit, a little bit. Alright, so... Let's see what kind of maps you guys have to uh, send me today, shall we? Mm -mm. Will you be playing Zelda in your free time? I'm gonna be completely honest, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say something that you guys may not like. I think Tears of the Kingdom looks like ass. If I'm, I'm gonna be complete, I hate the graphic. This like faded cartoon style, it's so ugly. I really don't like it. I mean, it's probably fun though. I mean, Zelda games are always fun. I really don't like the art style, I gotta be completely honest. Oof. This map looks like a handful. I don't think we're gonna accept that one. Breath of the Wild looked way prettier than Tears of the Kingdom. Breath of the Wild looked really fun. Oh, choke point central. Very funny, very funny, very funny, guys. Very funny, very funny. Yeah, amazing map, absolutely. It's a Switch game. Hey, Switch games can look pretty. Triangle Strategy was gorgeous. Octopath Traveler is gorgeous. What, what are you doing? Oh. Ah, this is from her in the mood. I don't hate it. I think it might be a bit too choky, though. There's too many units being funneled into the center. But, uh, I'll, I'll get it. Alright, let's take out, check out some more maps, shall we? I, I think the first battle we're gonna do today is gonna be a naval battle. 
How do you feel about the reboot camp after some time? I still don't like the graphics, but they are growing on me a little bit. And not a big fan of this one. Two bridges in the center makes it way too choky. I really ought to make that video somewhere I talk about how to make a good map. Hmm. High funds. Let's go. I kind of, I kind of want to do a high funds battle. Ooh. Ooh. This one's interesting. I'll say yes to that one. The graphics are growing on me a little bit. I'm still not majorly fond of them, but I hate them less. Ooh. This one looks decent. Looks like a fog map. Eh. Hmm. Ah, tentative no to that one. Man, should I play Final Fantasy Pixel Master? I have no idea what that is. <laughs> no. <laughs> the more... I think what they did to Otter was interesting. Uh, 2v2c. Well, it's a 2v2 map, so can't play it online. Sadly, no 2v2 online, just 1v1. I, I don't hate what they did to Adder. I also don't hate what they did to Jess. Ooh, what the hell? <laughs> so, what the? Okay, this is kind of funny, though. High fun space invader. So you have to destroy the cannon. Okay. Is this a naval bottle? It looks like a naval bottle. I kinda like it. Let's do it. Alright, check out another map. Optic Woods Fog of War. I like how you titled it Fog of War. Ooh! This one I like! Roads are a little ugly. But aside from that... This is a great, great looking map. I actually kind of like what they did with Adder. Transcendent. Mm, ah, not a lot going on here. I don't think this looks that fun to play on. There is a pixel remaster to Final Fantasy. <laughs> no. Looks good, but too big for online. Ah, yeah, right, right. At last, the diversion too. Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Ooh, a hope for Lord. Nice. You made hope for, but this. This, this is surely too big for online play, right? I'm still gonna grab it. Yeah, not all, not, it needs to say factory finale. What? It's another caustic finale variant. I have so many of those right now, I really don't need any more. I really don't need any more. Bum 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 bum. Kind of want to see a map with a death ray, volcano isle. Oh, Ephraim, this is a du this is from Dual Strike, isn't it? Doesn't look that fun to play on though. I gotta be completely honest, but it's a it's a cute looking map still. Caustic finale is overrated. Get out of my chat right now. How dare you speak such sacrilege? Ah, uh, nah, too choky in the middle. Swell Island, okay. Is this gonna be a naval battle map? Ooh. This one looks interesting. Huh. I'll take it. This looks like one of the maps I used to make back in the day. Mix DR Naval. Okay, cool. Let's see what this is. <laughs> Death? Oh my god, what the hell? A naval battle? With... With lasers? Wow. Let's try that one. Alright. Hey in the mood, the limited 50 Donkey Kongs. I don't have time to watch this time, but I'll send you some meme and fan art that I found. Great. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is uh we're gonna do we're gonna start things off with a naval battle, probably high funds. I'm gonna play Drake. 
and I want my opponent to play uh, someone broken, like Colin or Hachi. Maybe not Sturm, but like you can play Combi if you want. So, who wants to play me on a naval battle? Naval map. I play Drake. You guys play like a broken seal, like come by Colin, Hachi. Okay, all right, I'll. Hmm. Chorus, I'd like to. You need to actually say your username, though. Grit is a better naval commander than Drake? Oh, I, I disagree. You're welcome. Oh, Jalfon, what would you like to challenge me as Grit? Would you like to challenge me as Grit? Mine's Hioki. Okay, let's see if we can find Hioki here. Hioki, Hioki. There you go. All right, let's see what we can find here. So we gotta find a, na a proper naval battle. This one kind of sounds like fun, but it's also like, okay, so let me take a look at uh, where the HQs are. Is this balanced? No, I don't think so. There was, there was another one. We could do what are you doing maybe, or what are we isles? Was that, was that the one we were looking at last time? I think so. Ba 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 ba. All right, let's do watery isles. I'm gonna pick. Wait, is this advanced source one? There we go. All right, I'm gonna pick Drake. You pick some kind of broken okay. SEO. Pick grid if you want. That's okay with me. Should we do fog or no fo fog? Uh, let's do no fog for the for the first one. We're gonna do high fun, so 2k. Oh, I forgot to check how many properties there were on the map. Let's see, we have uh, 18 properties, 18 properties, 6 bases, and 4 harbors. So that means capture victory should be 21 properties. Ahoy! 21 properties, there we go. And we'll do 20 turns. Sounds like a good time. Okay. Let's go. Nathan donated 11 Canadian bucks. Nathan, eight. Oh, sorry, guy. I already picked my opponent. I appreciate the donation, though, but I do make it a habit to not let people donate their way into games because I don't want people to... I don't want, I don't want like, the matches to go to whoever has money. I, I'd like everyone to have an equal shot at playing me. If I wanted to milk my audience, I could probably, like, make people buy matches, but that just wouldn't sit right with me. I want everyone to have equal opportunity, man. So, uh, here's the thing. Here's the thing that I'm kind of curious about. Very curious about, in fact. Oh, looks like my green screen is a bit wonky. Let me fix that. There we go. So here's something I'm curious about. Can we... Can we see so... And, okay, you guys know how you can see the cursor of the opponent. Does this also apply to submarines? Oh cool, we start with a lander. He didn't he didn't move his lander though. Where can this lander go? Probably should send it around. So yeah. It is true that Grid's battleships are pretty damn strong, because they get 20% extra firepower and one extra range. But don't underestimate plus one movement on naval units. Seriously, do not underestimate plus one movement on naval units, and the extra defense. It is really good. 
Oh, the Drake theme is amazing, yeah. It is really good. I am so curious to see if we can see submarines move. Is this map not symmetrical? How so? How is it not symmetrical? Where is it not symmetrical? Shoal? Where? Oh no! There's a shoal missing! Oh no! I don't give a shit! Da -da. Shoalgate is back. Shoalgate is back, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I don't know which team I like more. Drake's team? Or Grit's team? Mangs, who is your favorite CO in terms of playstyle? Jess. I love Jess's just turbocharging, yeeting playstyle. The thing is, like, you might say, well, wouldn't you like Max more? No, because I like I like the occasional indirect. I think I think Jess Jess is by far the the funniest low tier. And what I like about Jess is that she's she's kind of bottom tier, so you can always pick her. Uh, and, uh, she's just so much fun. Like, turbocharge and overdrive are such- they just feel so much fun to use, and... Yeah, it sucks a little bit that our infantry are weaker, but it's like, yeah, you can play around that. Ooh, look at that! Extra movement lets naval units get to the island one turn sooner. That's what we like to see. That's what we like to see. So we only have one seaport to start things off with here. Wow, building artillery, okay, get it. Probably not a bad idea to get a third lander out here. The landers are gonna work over time to transport units around. I once tried to learn Grit's theme on guitar. It doesn't play on guitar at all. The chords just don't make any sense. You gotta be insanely good to play this on guitar. Have you ever been on a boat? Oh, I thought, what? why are you asking my girlfriend? Why are people asking Bethany? I'm the streamer here, guys. Focus on me. Okay, I'm joking. Jesus Christ. I hate boats. I hate these horses on these boats. Oh, the best OG meme. But you're not a woman. Damn straight I'm not a woman. Alright, let's get the base. Let's go for the central island. Oh, we have the first submarine deployed. I kinda would like to build a cruiser, but you guys know it's bad to base skip, so let's not do that. Hmm. Who base skipped? I didn't base skip. What are you talking about? Mangs is blocking his own harbor? No, I'm parking the lander on it, dumbass. Alright, here comes the artillery. Where are you gonna where are you gonna where are you gonna drop off that artillery, buddy? Oh, he's gonna he's gonna unload artillery on the island. That's what he's gonna do. One lander policy. <laughs> Never underestimate the one lander policy, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, you can see where the subs move. Okay, he hasn't dived it yet, though. 
I am so curious to see if you can see dive sub movements uh, outside of Fog of War. Second attack, donated two bucks to Super Chat. It's Shulver. Okay, so let's drop off some infantry here on the island. We can drop one infantry in here. Do, 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 do. All right. 28,000, ladies and gentlemen. I would build a battleship, but I need to get a cruiser out. <laughs> Look at that cruiser with his radar. All right, so this submarine is right here now. You gotta be careful. Although it is a grit submarine, so it kind of sucks, but that's to be expected. Yep, no carriers in this game. <laughs> Drake reminds me of my dad, a big fat sailor, dude. Ooh, okay. Someone's getting feisty with the artillery, okay. Okay, so he died the sub now. We need to we need to watch next turn what happens when he tries to move it if we get to see it at all because I can see his cursor right so I hope we will get to see great battleships oh you will oh you will for sure Being a soldier under an advanced war CEO sounds like death. <laughs> oh, this is why I made the Deathless series. I felt so sorry for them. Alright, we have to watch a little bit of animation. We'll do we'll do visual B. So I could attack the artillery. I could bring it down to like 8 HP. I think that's probably worth it, honestly. Do this. Take a bit of a bite out of that artillery. Nice, got some luck damage from it as well. Nice. Okay, and then we can bring an infantry over here and use this lander right here to ferry these guys aboard. Oh, we have enough for a battleship. Should we get one? It would require us the base kit, but it, it's tempting. I kind of want to get it. Oh god, I, you can just. Okay, so here's the dive submarine. Okay, all right, so I spotted it. I kind of need to get a submarine of my own, so I think I'm going to get a submarine right here. Don't worry, guys. The battleships will come. The battleships will come. Yeah, infantry can spot, uh, okay. Do, 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 do. Glorified sea rockets are incoming. Yeah, they are. They sure are. Alright, so there goes this, uh... Yeah, I can just see where he moves his sub. Okay. Wow. That's really funny. I can just see where he moves the submarine now. Good job, Reboot Camp. You just made subs even more shit. <laughs> but is it because I can see it though? Look, you can you can just see where he moves the sub now. It's not hidden. Bruh. 
bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. It could be because we saw it. Yes, it absolutely could be. It could be. Let, let's see what happens when it moves away, maybe. Okay, okay, now it vanished. So I, I, I didn't see where it moved to, but I saw the cursor, so I still know what tile it's on. I still saw what tile it was on. Oh, there's the first grit battleship coming out, ladies and gentlemen. There's the first grit battleship coming out. Da -da 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 -da. Do you think Manx will remember its position? Of course I will. Da, 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 da. They will never update this game. Actually, they just released a patch that fixes Olaf's AI, or so people tell me in the comment section. Brook. Oh, look at that cute little grit artillery trying to shoot on my island. Alright, I like this artillery right here, just getting peppered by by infantry. Do you think Adder might be considered a Quishling? That's the weirdest fucking question I've ever gotten. What makes you compare Adder to Quishling? Alright, so we have the first grit battleship out. Crazy, look at this thing. His yeah maybe I I really don't know man I really don't know. All right, let's get another submarine out. Don't worry, we will get battleships out eventually. Adders have sexy boots in his art. His boots are pretty good, I will admit. Oh, grits long, veiny, thick range. Okay, pay attention now. Let's see if we can see him move his sub. Quishling is a historical... is a Norwegian guy who, um... During the Second World War, sympathized with the invaders. There was a big event, someone named Max Manus. He's a bit of a Norwegian folk hero. They were gonna, like, conscript a bunch of uh, Norwegian teenagers to fight in the Second World War. And then what happened was Max Manus broke into Quisling's archives, and he burned the conscription lists along with a few saboteurs. Which meant that they, um... Which meant that they, that they couldn't draft the Norwegian teenagers to fight in the war. So many people say that Max Monus' uh, sabotage of that operation meant that thousands of Norwegian teen teenagers got spared. So uh, that, it's a, it's a story that uh, I I could be getting some details wrong. I'm not super good on the story. Okay, can we see the sub move? I can't see him move the sub anymore. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah. Uh, he moved it and we didn't see it. Okay. Alright. So we didn't see where he moved it. You don't need to see it, you hear it. You, you were always able to hear enemy u unit movement in Avance Wars. The sub was the friends we made along the way, indeed. 
All right, has it built a single cruise here yet? I don't think so. I do not think so, no. We almost have enough. We almost have enough for a battleship, but not quite. Let's get some more infantry. Ferry. I, th I think I built a lot more landers than he did, which I think is definitely uh, serving me well on this uh, conflict. Let's see, what about... We have two more infantry units over here that we gotta get to. I think I'm just gonna put this guy over here, and then I'm just gonna keep shooting on this uh, artillery. I'm gonna take shelling from Grid's battleship next turn, which kind of sucks. I just realized block boats are the least expensive naval units of 7,500. Wait a minute, how much did gunboats cost in Days of Ruin? Weren't they cheaper? Pretty sure they were cheaper. Alright. Oh, this battleship, man. This freaking battleship. Oh shit, did I just move my my uh Oops, I just moved my lander in range of his uh black boat. Oopsie. Or sorry, his battleship. That was uh definitely not intentional. I wish cruisers could attack naval. Yeah, they're they're the worst unit by far. Ah shit! Now he's attacking me with artillery from that side. Yeah, this is gonna be a tough. It'll be a tough map to face Grid on. Not gonna lie. This is gonna be a tough map to face Grid on. Someone's gonna get trapped on a submarine, sooner or later. Doctor Victim donated 50 Swedish crowns for Super Chat. If you, if you could be a soldier under an advanced force CO, which CO's command would you be? Also, Andy has a receding hairline, does he not? Uh, I would obviously be under Nell because, uh, haha, <laughs> he got trapped. Actually, he just revealed. I would be a CO under Nell, obviously, because she's lucky. And also, who wouldn't want to be underneath Nell? Is something I would say if I was single, which I'm not. Oh, hi there! Ooh, attacking a Drake sub on a reef. Interesting. Look at that, look at that. Sub almost taking... dealing as much damage as it's taking. da na 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 Remember, guys, it's better to be a bussy saka than a sussy baka. <laughs> Spirit of Fire donated two bucks. Hope you're enjoying the map. Sorry about the shoal. It's okay. Speaking from experience, it's quite easy to forget the shoal. What's the battleship gonna do, though? It's just gonna move? Alright, he's moving it. The, the grit battleship zoning has begun. Ooh, okay, he's picking up some people in the lander, alright. Disgusting Lash is the only CEO I would serve. Yeah, I'm sure she'd, uh... Ooh. Interesting. Maybe I... I'm, I'm sure Lash would treat you very well. Alright, he okay? Speed it up a little bit, will ya? You're playing like my grandma. Do 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 do. <laughs> the end's just turning me. No, I didn't mean end turn. <laughs> I feel mean now. All right. 
Should we just continue to attack? Or should, I mean, so he has, he built, oh, now he built this. okay, so now I built a cruiser, that's nice. Okay, I think I'm just gonna keep attacking a sub, honestly. I want to be cloned by Lash, don't we all? There we go. Of course, now I have to be careful because he's, naval units generate powerful, he already has a snipe attack. Nice. Very nice. Nice knife. Let's, uh... Try and... I say we try and kill this uh, artillery first and foremost. There we go. Get rid of it. And I kind of want to unload more units onto the shoreline right here. So I think what I'm going to do is... Oh, wait, can I... Oh, I can capture this property now. Nice. Very nice, very nice. So that means we can do this. And fire even more infantry. Okay, so his cruiser is here now, so we gotta be careful about that. We definitely don't want to lose ours. That would be very bad. We do have enough for a battleship now. I'm wondering if maybe maybe it's time to make one. All right, let's go, Drake battleships. Do -do 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 -do. So we have some one one HP infantry here. I think that's fine. Gotta be careful. He might he might attempt to unload some units on our doorstep next turn. Shane Bob, donated two bucks. Days of Ruin, Cruiser Supremacy. Yeah, yeah. Days of Ruin cruisers are great. I like him. Oh, he's popping it. You can't hide. He's popping it. Max, do you like this map? It's okay. Uh, I I need to play the game fully on it first before I make up my mind. But I think it's good. It's a little choky in the center, but it does put heavy units emphasis on naval units, which I think is is cool. Damn that grit! Ah, look at that firepower! Woo! Oh, 127 damage against my lander. Oh, look, it's parked up on the beach. Oh, that's kind of adorable. Don't I'm out, bow, bow. Lander Chan, no, that was kind of cute, honestly. Oh, hi there. Ooh, it's delivering more artillery. Oh, okay, someone's getting feisty with the transports. Someone's getting feisty with the transports. It's okay, I got more. I got many more. Okay, this is kind of actually kind of scary though. With the artillery he has on his island, he could seriously threaten my island properties. So we got to be very careful about that. And now a cruiser is coming in as well. Four, five, six. Yeah, your battleship's in danger, buddy. Your, your battleship's in danger. But he might have moved a submarine to block me. Second attack, donated 20 bucks through Super Chat. Be me. An orange star grunt under the command of Nell being used as a meat shield for the medium tanks behind me. Sudden black hole neo tanks roll into view. I empty my M16 into the tanks and suddenly all three of them explode. <laughs> yep. That's what it's like being in Nell infantry. Subs have five move? Oh, do you forget who I am? Little person in chat. Do you forget who you're talking to? Five move, you say? Drake chats. Keep on winning! 
I told you, the one extra movement on naval units is really good. It's really good. Alright, so this cruiser is a little nasty right now, but... Okay, oh, hi there! I knew that submarine was hiding here somewhere. Oh no, I didn't kill the submarine! Well, at least I can move my uh, my battleship in range so that if his, if his cruiser decides to move in, it's gonna get shot. Of course, I gotta be a little bit careful about these artillery, but they have power right now, so they have one extra range compared to what they usually have. And I obviously cannot allow him to start capturing my property, that would be bad. Should've put your sub in a spot where it couldn't be revealed. Yeah, that's fair, that's fair. Ooh, you didn't kill my infantry, dude? That's a big mistake. That is a big mistake, I would say so. Oh my god, you just gave me two properties, really? That's uh, that's a blunder, I think. Mangs, when can we get another core inquests? Uh, are they shutting the Nintendo online shop down soon? Because if they announce that they're shutting it down, then I kind of have to. Then I kind of have to do a core inquests. I kind of want to build another battleship, not gonna lie. Okay, I'm building another battleship, I don't care. But I, okay, so his battleship has now taken some serious damage. Which is good. Oh, our sub is, our submarine is running low. Oh, our landers are running low on fuel, I gotta heal them up soon. You, okay, you visited a castle the other night. Okay, makes sense. I don't see any more submarines around here, but I guess there's no point in... Oh, wait, no. What did he build here? Okay, built another cruiser. Okay, so I guess I'll keep my... I'll move it down. Alright, I think we're going to get Typhoon next turn. Yeah, the steel drum and Drake's theme goes hard. Yeah, it's one of my favorite aspects of it, for sure. Yeah, it's still worth it. You can base skip on a map like this. It's more important to get naval units out. Does Andy counter Kindle and Dual Strike? Not really. I wouldn't say he does. Um, he can repair her Urban Blight. It's true, but you gotta you gotta understand what you want to do against Andy is you want to deal damage to his units so you can one shot them. So any global damage CO doesn't get countered by Andy per se. It's just. It depends on how good you are, I guess. It depends on who can make the most out of it. That's what it's really all about. Alright, who's he gonna attack? You can't visit castles anymore, really? Wait, 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 wait. You can't visit castles anymore in Fates? Then I can't do a core quest, can I? Oh, you can. Okay, okay. So it's still it's still available. All right. Okay. You can. Okay. Good. 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 And his best matchup is Rachel, if you can control her missiles. Yeah, uh, some people go as far as to say that uh, that Andy hard counters Rachel on certain maps, which she definitely, which he does, he does for sure. 
It really depends on where you can make them. Like, on three base maps in particular, he definitely does. Do you play Fire Emblem Heroes on mobile? I used to, but the power creep kind of turned me away from the series. I still pay attention to the banners whenever they release, although... Heroes as a game has not interested me for ages. Like, the, the weapon descriptions just keep getting longer. The boobs keep getting bigger. The power creep keeps getting larger. And they're not adding many interesting modes to the game at all. Many people seem to like the Advanced Wars Reboot Cap. We're gonna have to wait and see how the sales numbers. But, um, I'm not sure, actually. Oh, let's go. Ooh. Hello there. Is this, is, the, is this a battleship? No, it's a cruiser. Okay. Alright, so we're very close to getting a Typhoon. If we... If I attack after I pop it, then it might be better. Alright, I think the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my cruiser here to kill the submarine. Manx, did you receive my Hawk music? I did. Um, I was gonna give you a response, but you need to work on it a little bit, I think. Uh, it had some weird guitar riffs. I didn't have time to respond to it. Okay, I think we can pop Typhoon now. Let's go! Prepare to be washed away! I turn up the sound for Drake's power theme. What's wrong with Booba? Not everyone plays Fire Emblem Heroes with their pants up. I don't like, I don't mind boobs, but I think boobs should be consistent through art. Like, I don't, I don't mind Kagro having like F cups. I think Kagro looks great. She's one of my favorite waifus. Um, but I don't like it when they take a character who canonically has B cups and they give her E cups. I think it's cheap. I think it, it, it. it it kind of reveals a bit of an insecurity about their own assets. It's like, oh, we can only like sell orbs if we have massively oversized boobs on the characters. I think it. I think it's a betrayal of the character's design. Boob size, just like hair color, hair length, height, slant, like body type. It, it's it's imperative to a character's how they look. When you take a character and you just volume. It's some it's it's on purpose, see friend. Yeah, Ephraim, I I literally just said I turned the music up because of Drake's power theme. I always whenever I pop my powers, I always turn the volume up because the sound song is really cool. Oh, it's too loud. Now, you guys misunderstand my point. I don't have a problem with boobs. I have a problem when they increase a character's cup size by four sizes. I think it's cheap. There, there are plenty of boobas in, in heroes that you could always rely on. If you want tits, just put cargo on a banner. Alright, I think... Uh, let's turn off animation, speed things up a little bit. Okay, let's put the battleship here, I think. Let's see, can we interrupt here? We can. Manx, do you think there will be cheat, cheat codes in this game? I don't think so. I haven't heard anything about cheat codes. Cheat codes are such an old-school concept. I don't think most games come with cheat codes anymore, do they? More battleships. <laughs> Okay, we gotta be careful though. Fuel is low at this point. Cheat 
cheat codes, I think, was something that the developers made to test their games, and then they just, like, didn't take them out after development. That's a bit of an easter egg. You also gotta keep in mind that people used to sell, like, game magazines before, and in these game magazines, they would have cheat codes uh, often to sell those game mags. Like, I think there was a Nintendo magazine called Nintendo Power, and the whole appeal... Take you down. The whole appeal of Nintendo Power was to sell cheat codes, basically. I mean, to you Zoomers, before we had the internet, we had to go buy magazines to get our cheat codes. I know, it's weird. I know, I know some of my younger audience probably don't remember a time without the internet, but I do. So, like, if you were the kid who knew all the cheat codes, you were pretty cool. Um, actually, sure, she's a B cup, not a G cup, but actually agree, though. Lamau. Actually, actually, you're consistently wrong about the boob size. I have this. I have analyzed the boob size of over 100 Fire Emblem girls, and you gotta. You are actually wrong. The mm -hmm. Lara Croft naked code. That is actually a myth. That code never existed. The developers just joked and said it did. No, C Manx just doesn't like boobs. Lies. I may be I may have a girlfriend, but I will not debase myself by lying. Boom 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 boom. Now I'm in the mood for eating ice cream. Oh, I got a I bought- have, have you guys- okay. I bought some, uh, pro pudding. Pro put chocolate pudding. It's keto, uh, chocolate pudding. It's so fucking good. Have you guys- any- any, any keto bros in chat here? It's so fucking good. It's like a protein chocolate pudding with no sugar in it. It's so fucking good. I bought, like, they're super expensive, like any other, uh, keto food, but I have, like, five of them in the fridge. I'm gonna have one after the stream. I'm looking forward to it. Sounds edible. Oh, who cares? It's good. <laughs> Do you drink shots of olive oil? No, but I have a lot of olive oil on my food. Olive oil is fucking delicious. 14 fuel left. I might have to get myself an APC. Yeah, I need an APC here. All right, let's see, what do we have here? Who can we shoot on? We can shoot on more artillery, that's good, kill that. So we have a cruiser here, and uh, we have a very damaged battleship. Yeah, let's get our submarines out of here before they crash. And what's going on here, a lander? I think we need more submarines, guys. Ooh, nice little artillery sitting all there by itself. There we go. Yeah, let's not sink our own subs due to lack of fuel. That would be very bad. Let's build a let's build this copy this grid player and build a build an artillery on, on our island to ward away landers. Okay, ah, uh, cruiser can just stay put for now. Wave the white flag of war. I think I'm in a good position. I'm telling you guys, Grit can't beat Drake in a naval battle. That plus one range on battleships don't mean jack. When you're just getting murdered by submarines. A lot of the boobage is just art style differences. I, I wholeheartedly disagree with you. I disagree with you so hard. There are some interpretations, sure. But no, Fire Emblem Heroes up the cup size of every female in it by like three sizes at least. At least. Not for every woman, but for a lot of them. 
how good is movement in advanced wars? It's pretty broken to have plus one day-to-day -day movement. This is one of the reasons why Drake is really good in evil battles. His subs in particular are just really solid. Pretty sure no, we didn't change. No, they they don't change the lollies because they know what not what they know what the target audience of Noe is. So of course they're not gonna give Noe tits. That's this is the golden rule of Fire Emblem Heroes. Okay, if she has boobs, make them bigger. If she has no boobs, don't make them bigger. Because yeah, we all know it. I mean, we all know it. I mean, the Noe debate is is old and outdated at this point, and I'm kind of lost interest in it. I've accepted that. You know, I've accepted that no is there, and uh, I don't like it. I don't like the target demographic that, that she's catering to, but it's kind of just one of those things you kind of just have to admit defeat, you know? You can't really do anything about it. It's there. Uh, it's a. It's kind of like a weird part of the Fire Emblem franchise that, you know, that, that's just how it is. I <laughs> just connected and there's a booba topic. Yeah, you joined at the perfect time. That being said, I do think that there exists people who are fans of Noe without being those kinds of people. I'm not gonna like... I'm not defending fans of Noe, but I, I do think that there are people who exist who are not like that, who just like her. I mean, surely they exist, right? Oh, hi there. Nice cruiser you got there, buddy. Would be a shame if something were to happen to it. Maybe I should just combine my submarines together. I actually don't know. Like four of them. Yeah, I mean, they, they deserve to be hurt too, right? All right, we need more submarines, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, let's uh, drop off the APC. We need a mobile fuel source over here. Let's see, yeah, this fuel is- this, this submarine's about to sink, so we gotta do something about that. Okay, we have a battleship over here too, that's important. His battleship is very damaged though, so we can probably just move into it like so. Okay, no, wait, there's another battleship right here. Gotta be careful about that. We don't want to get caught in the crosshairs of that. If Noah was an adult instead of a child, actually appreciate some aspect of her outfit except the ugly heart battle and shards. Yeah, maybe? I don't know. I guess you aren't a fan of magical girls either? What? What does that mean? I'm not a fan of magical girls? I don't care if they're magical or not. I care about what the waifu looks like physically. Like, if you told me Citrine was 5,000 years old, I wouldn't care. Citrine's still pretty. So how is the new Zelda game, anyway? Is anyone playing it? Is it good? I heard it leaked. Nintendo were pretty pissed. They were like, what the fuck? We're gonna crack down on emulators now. Zelda's pretty good. It's, uh, 70 bucks? Oh my goodness. Too expensive? 70 bucks? Really? That sounds like a lot. Pretty great with some nice cool surprises. Everybody loves it. Wow, here we go. Buy coupons? Coupons? Yeah, Advance Wars was 60 bucks to be honest, which was way too much. 
this re this remake definitely wasn't worth 60. I hate magical girls when they put the obviously minor children into skimpy out. Oh, oh is this magical girls? This is like an archetype I haven't heard about. So we got two landers here. <laughs> More like two dead landers, am I right? Oh shit, I forgot to re- Oh shit, five fuel! Oh crap! Ooh, your landers are dead, buddy. Your landers are dead, buddy. Sucks to suck. I think I'll just combine the submarine into this one. Oh, it actually undives them. What the hell? Did it always used to do that? Wait, wait a minute. I thought... I thought undiving... Oh shit, we got rockets. Gotta be careful. Sneaky rockets right here. Let's go back here. Get some more infantry on the island. Yeah, I, I pretty much have total dominance over this island right now. Don't think there's much he can do about that. I think you've lost, my friend. I, I, I don't see any way out of this one, honestly. Don't get me up. All right, comes the sniper attack, though. Let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Reboot Camp still does not have a Japanese. Is it ever gonna get released to Japan? I don't think it is. Oh shit, my battleship. Oh no. Oh, 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 I saw him move a sub. I think that was the submarine, right? Oh yeah, he's totally lost. Uh, you know, he okay if you're watching this. I don't think you can win this because it's six days left and you don't have any infantry headed towards my island. So uh, I, I I do think you have lost. Uh, I I don't see any way you can win. I mean, go ahead and try, but I don't think it's gonna work. Okay, except for those two, I guess. But look at all the infantry I have on my island. They're just gonna interrupt you. I'm not convinced this would do well in Japan. I have a feeling it wouldn't, no. I think the Japanese likes the originals. Yeah. Land ho! Yeah. Uh, commendable, commendable. Commendable. Thank you for surrendering and letting others play. That's uh, nice of you. But yeah, you can't beat like it's a, almost impossible to beat Drake on an evil map, even as grid. Oh, nice. Got an achievement. Sweet. Have you lost once? Yes, to her the mode playing as Max actually. All right, let's go check out some more maps. What about Colin? I could... It would be fun to fight Colin next, actually. Colin versus... Uh, he loses a ton on the monsters by web. Well, yeah, of course I lose in competitive matches. <laughs> no. Colin versus Kambai. Hmm. Hachi versus Sturm. I don't have... I don't know how much you unlocked yet. I need to play the last two missions. Eh, uh, no thank you. It'd be fun to play against Colin, not gonna lie. Colin, uh, tried to beat Colin as Jess or something. Pre-deploy planes. Okay, I like, the, I like the look of these, actually. It's, they're kind of nice. Yeah, I need to beat the two final missions on Classic. I just didn't do it yet. No. 
how to unlock Hachi. You got a 100% the uh, Advance Wars 2 campaign. Huh, bad star idea. It's a three player map though, so it's kind of useless. I can't play on it. This game is 10 bucks above Engage, really? Egg Mang's Isles. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's funny. Huh. That's kind of cute. It's like a nice naval map. I'll take it. I'll take it. He okay? Isn't that the guy I just played against? River crossing, high funds. Huh. Hmm. Ah, not a big fan of uh, how this one looks, sadly. R R T I. Ooh. Look at that. With the death ray in the middle. Looks a little choky though, not gonna lie. I'll take it though, it looks fun. Would you do a, a guide to creating maps? Yeah, I will, I will. Oh shit, I didn't even see that map, but we accepted it. So, uh, it better be good. Diamond Pit, okay. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> Sorry, that doesn't look fun to play on at all. Andy's Adventure? Okay. Oh, it's the first map of Andy's Adventure. It's cool, but I can't really play on it, so I don't want to waste a slot on it. I only have 50 slots, so... Laser Cannon, okay. Ooh! Oh, look at this one! It has a Laser Cannon in the center, and Black Cannons. This one looks fun! Alright, let's go. I'm gonna... I'd like to play this one in a fog match against Colin, but for the love of God, I want to play against someone who plays fast. I... I don't want to play against someone who plays super slow, so... If someone wants to play Colin against me, but please be a fast player. Like, be a snappy player, please. And don't stream snipe. Hey, Ephraim! I'd love to play Ephraim. Let's, uh, I'm gonna play Ephraim. Okay, Ephraim. Please be fast enough to make bad decisions. Yes. Called out by my own girlfriend right here. Alright, let's uh, see what kind of maps we have available here. Okay, Ephraim, you can play whoever you want. You don't have to pick Colin. Ah, there we go. Let's invite Ephraim to a match, and let's uh, let's try that one, Laser Cannon. That one looks weird. That's a weird-ass map. That is a weird-ass map. Lots of properties, though. Holy shit, look at that. 32, plus 8, plus 2 airports. 42, oh my goodness, that's a lot of properties. 31 is the capture limit here. Okay, I think I'm gonna let chat. I'm gonna let chat pick my CO today. So, uh, let's see. Uh, let's ask. What do you pick my CO? We'll do Jess, Flack, uh, who else do you wanna see? Two seals I haven't played yet. Hawk. Do Nell and Hawk. Hawk is pretty strong though, so if I pick Hawk, then Ephraim better pick someone strong as well. Alright, the poll is up. You guys decide. Ooh, it's actually very even. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That's very even. Alright, I'm gonna count down from 15. 15. 
14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, whoosh. Looks like Hawk won. So Hawk is pretty strong here for him, so you can pick a strong CO as well if you want. Ah, yes. Fog of War on. Capture is gonna be 41. Let's make it 40. Uh, weather clear, turns will do... We'll do 20 turns, but resign if either player is looking like they're winning. All right, invitation sent. Oh, 31, okay, all right. Uh, I was gonna say, sorry, sorry, that was way too many. That was way too many. Sorry, friend, I'm gonna invite you again. I'm gonna invite you again. I put I picked the wrong capture limit. I'm gonna invite you again, Ephraim. Fog with rain? Oh god, no. We could do random weather though. For fun. Yeah, multiplayer matches are sadly limited to 1v1, yeah. Yeah, we'll do 30 capture. That sounds good. Uh, visuals off. Weather. We'll do random weather. That sounds like it could be fun. 20 turns. Alright, let's go. Wait. Visuals off. Power on. Capture 30. Turns 20. Plants 1000. Weather random. We're on, let's go. You asked for it, I guess so. Is he gonna pick Colin? Is he gonna play Colin? House online? It's bare bones. You can play one where we versus friends, that's pretty much about it. Drake? Really? You're gonna get murdered, dude. Ephraim... E Ephraim, seriously? You're gonna get murdered. Dude, you're gonna get fucking murdered, dude. Ephraim, are you sure? Ah, uh, okay. You do know that Hawk absolutely fucking murdered. Oh my god, there's so many bases too. Look at this shit. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, shit, there's laser cannon on the airport. What the fuck? I didn't even realize. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Oops. I completely forgot about that. HQ is on the weak side? Uh, I guess so. Four based, mixed based, Sony versus Hawk. This is gonna be rough for you, Ephraim. First Mango Arrow. I completely forgot about that laser cannon. So yeah. But here's the thing though, you can still get the airport. You can still get the airport if you want to. If I just like join cap. I mean, I'll, I'll technically... I'll technically get it after like five turns. <laughs> It's 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 about being persistent, ladies and gentlemen. It's all about just being persistent. Oh shit, there's a cannon there, but can it see me? 
It cannot, I think. Either that or it shoots on my turn. Yeah, lasers fire every day, they do, yeah. So wait, do the black cannons need vision to shoot on me, or will it shoot at the start of my turn? Maybe it will. Mang's misplaying hard right now. Nah, 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 this is a strategical. This is strategic. I'll probably kill that cannon, honestly. It's annoying as fuck. What are the rules for the campaign cannons? I, 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 I think they shoot once every turn. Oh, my infantry is out of range. You're right about that, yeah. It's very annoying how the how the map zooms back into normal after after every turn in Fog of War. I don't know why it does that. It's really weird. This is a wild map though. Four base mixed base. That's kinda insane. I mean, I'll get the airport in four turns if I just keep capping. Right? Yeah, the volcano was really slow. I admit, I I'll admit that. The volcano was extremely slow. Uh, Fiddler donated two bucks for Super Chat. Do you think you could send me all your maps? That would take a very long time. I'm sorry, I just don't have that time. It takes a long time to send a map, so... Maybe I can work out some kind of, like, patron deal or something where I send maps to my patrons if they want to. But, uh, sitting and, like, sending one-on-one -on -one map to each of my friends, that will take- that would take me, like, 24 hours. I wonder if the cannon will reveal- Ooh, that's a good point! Yeah, if the cannon starts shooting, you know where the units are, right? Oh, yeah, I could show the maps off in full so you could recreate them. That's true. I could do that. Oh, hi there, Ephraim. How are you doing? Hi there, Ephraim. That didn't take long. 24 hours well spent, I guess so. Yeah, you're right about that. Oh yeah, Sonia's hidden HP. It's very annoying. It's very annoying. I'm not a big fan of it. Good evening, Mangs. I picked up the reboot camp after watching your playthrough for the first time. Since uh, playing since well, I, me couldn't beat Grim and Dual Strike. Oh, I really want to see the Dual Strike. Uh, I really want to see the Dual Strike CS get added. Oof is asking 24 hour stream when? Well, I don't really do 24 hour streams anymore because. If you stream about 12 hours, people can't watch it, so it's basically pointless. I would want to, though. There's just no point in doing it. Oh, hi there. I got trapped! No! Alright. Sonya infantry in rivers. Pretty scary, pretty scary. So, yeah, this, this cannon is kind of blocking off over here. Which is kind of helping me right now, not gonna lie, like... Are there Sony infantry here? No? Hmm... I'm telling you, this map... is about to become pretty crazy. 10,000, what should we build? Uh, do do do... Might want to get some recons, maybe? Probably some recons. Oh, there's labs here. I really wish we could get 24 hour stream mods. That'd be nice. The cannon only fires at players who are in the range of the cannon. Here's the question though if there are two infantry units from each player, who will the cannon shoot at? I'd say the top left unit, probably. I think that's how it worked in the GBA games. Both? Oh, it fires each turn? Really? Ah. Oh. 
That would, that could be pretty insane, actually. The cannons fire at each player once. Okay, all right. So it works quite differently to the laser cannons, then. That poor single infantry taking all the lasers. Yeah, he'll... Don't feel sorry for him. He'll cap the airport soon enough. Your 24-hour stream still works, but yeah, new streams might be unstable. Um, well, what's the point of doing it? I mean, you can do a stream, I guess, for those who are there, but it kind of sucks that people can't watch it back, you know? So the best thing to do is 12-hour streams, because they can be watched. <laughs> nice luck there, dipshit. <laughs> it's just Sonya things. Ba -da -ba -ba. The airport is taking a laser uh, bath. Yeah, I mean, I like to think that it's just one guy left and the laser just goes over his head or something. Oh, we got snow. We got snow. Oh shit, can't move around anymore. Do, 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 do. Boosh. Dead. Well, that's mild, mildly inconvenient to our capture phase, but not a huge problem. Do, ooh, hi there. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, we got a tank. We got a tank. Yeah, I'm not attacking uh, Sonya infantry on a city. They fire back really hard. That's not fun at all. Oh, hi there. More infantry. Huh. I'm thinking maybe one of these. Maybe one of these. One of these. This is actually like a pretty recon heavy map because there's a lot of roads and infantry everywhere. And you need the vision, so... What about making a 24-hour stream, but make it 12 times 2 hours? Yeah, 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 absolutely. You could do that. Yeah, yeah, you could absolutely do that. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that shot on him! Look at that! Look at that! That's cute. Yeah, you could do two 12-hour streams in a row. That's very possible. A little clunky, but it's doable. Have a content, co con constant snow match with Olaf. I tried that once uh, during one of my advanced first by web streams. I played Olaf with constant snow on, and I beat Hachi. Hachi gets murdered by Olaf with constant snow. I think Olaf with snow, Olaf with constant snow, is probably the strongest CEO in the game. I don't think Sturm can fight him. I don't think Hachi can fight him. Your capture phase is just garbage. You, you don't reach any cities. Uh, he is seriously powerful in, in permanent snow. What did I get shot out there? Was that an artillery? I think that's an artillery. Yeah, that's an artillery. Another tank. Oh, hi there, Sonya. Drake with constant rain renders counters Olaf. Drake in constant rain would be pretty strong. Not as strong as Permus no Olaf, but pretty strong. Honestly, yeah. Uh, if someone wants to challenge me as Olaf with Sturm, with constant snow on, we could do that next match. I can show you just how broken he is. Oh no, he interrupted my <laughs> Ephraim, do you know how many turns that guy had capped the airport? How dare you? How dare you, sir? How dare you? He had worked very hard for that. He had worked very hard for that. How cruel. How cruel. Oh, we got more tanks. I gotta build some tanks too now if I don't want to get wrecked. Oh, oh. Okay, 
So this recon got a bit shredded. That's okay, though. Luckily, a uh, bad, a, a weakened recon still sees just fine. Uh, I think I still would like to interrupt this, though. Oh, there's the artillery. Hi. How you doing? I think I'm gonna have to do a little bit of a base skip here. I need a tank down here. It's actually kind of important. I don't normally condone base skipping, but uh, in this situation, it's probably a good idea. Ah, eh, that's fine. He can, he can keep shooting at me. That's okay. Man, this map is wild. Bonko. Huh? Ha <laughs> ha! His infantry got attacked again. <laughs> 2003 Max condones base skipping. Sometimes it's okay to base skip. Sometimes it's okay to base skip. Not always, but sometimes. Wait a minute. Do we not see the amount of cities captured now? Or is it just on my turn? When you have four bases, it's fine. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, you only see it on my turn. Okay, 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 okay. I love how people are making maps with the campaign gimmicks. Yeah, there's a lot of fun things you can do in the map editor for sure. He has 17 cities. Okay, all right. Any terrain-heavy map is great for Sturm. Honestly, yeah, I mean, sure, we'll do that as the third match. Olaf versus Sturm is in perma snow. Let me tell you guys, I think Olaf will win. I think Olaf wins, because Sturm doesn't get his perfect movement anymore, which is one of the reasons why he's so scary. He doesn't get it. Ah, Ephraim found my artillery. Builds another tank. Well, Sturm isn't weak to snow. He's just as weak as other COs in the snow. I think they removed the... the didn't they remove the uh, dossier where it says he's weak in the snow? It just says he gets slowed down in snow now, which is much more accurate. Oh, wow. He's actually doing fairly well on capture. Well, of course, I just picked up two cities this turn, which is... Uh, There we go. Now we're almost equal again. Alright, so I got a tank, but I can't strike his tank. At least not from here. Hmm. Yeah, that airport. Looks like no one is capping that airport. Do, 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 do. Alright, gotta be a little careful with our RD here. Don't want it to die. Same thing with this little recon buddy right here. Huh, because this lab is also kind of like smack dab in the center here. There's no point in attacking here, it's just going to get killed. Thirteen thousand. What should we do with thirteen thousand, I wonder? Well, if I'm just built more tanks over here, I could probably do with a tank up here, honestly. And then uh, an infantry here, and an infantry here. Get the airport. So, I could build an artillery and kill the, the laser cannon, but that would unlock the airport for Ephraim as well. So, I don't know how good that would be. That would require me to invest into an artillery, though. I don't know how good that would be. Wow, he really doesn't want to let me get that city, huh? Use the weak 2 HP infantry. We'll see. Okay, he's coming on pretty hard from the northwest now. I would like to get Battlecopters, but yeah, that... Honestly, guys, this map is really good. I'm not gonna lie, like, this map is really good. It's well made. The cannons are positioned interestingly. 
the laser cannon actually adds an element of inter like uncertainty to this map where you have to kill it to get like honestly I like it. I, this could be a global, like, this could be a global league map on a Monster vs. Spy Web. I, I would enjoy it. I, I would very much enjoy this as a global league map. I think the addition of, the addition of laser cannons and, and mini cannons is extru is, is a really cool addition. And if used well, it can really spice up a map. Like, everyone knows where the black cannon and the laser cannons will fire. Everyone knows where it will fire. So it makes a lot of sense how to move around. Drifting Breath, another two bucks Volcano for Wars will win. I will I will vehemently campaign for volcanoes and, and, and stuff for Wars World. I want it. I, I really want it. The laser cannon has first turn advantage in how it only procs at the start of player one's turn though. Only player one gets that initial reaction to anything hit by it. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. That could be that could be difficult to balance. Yeah, that's actually very true. That it, that would be hard to balance. Because player one has the advantage of the laser cannon dealing damage and then moving forward and attacking. If player two should position themselves in range of the laser cannon, that is. Sonia sweep. Sonia actually isn't bad on this map because there's so much forests, but uh, she's gonna struggle once the black storm comes in, and it's gonna come in a lot sooner than you think. It may start slowly, but once the match starts ramping up, and there starts to be a lot of economy on both sides. All right, so 18 properties to 17. All right, we need to think right now. At least we get one here, which is nice. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I don't know what's over here. I really don't. Okay, that's a full HP infantry. Let's pull back here. No sense in... No sense in wasting units. Hmm. Oh! I ran right into that trap, I guess. Oh wow, double artillery, interesting. Okay. Risky, but uh, I, I commend Ephraim for his effort, at least. It's, uh, it's a risky play. Alright, let's see if we can interrupt this cap once and for all. There we go, bye-bye. And I think I'm gonna interrupt this, even though I'm gonna take a lot of damage back. Let's go into the mountain and see what we can see. Built another tank. Uh, we could actually, if we're feeling a bit feisty, we can do this. Draw one of his tanks out. So it looks like he's moving a lot of tanks over here. I'm kind of protected by the cannons, though, so that's kind of nice. The cannons actually make it hard for Ephraim to attack here, because look at, look at how they're covering. You can kind of, like, hunker down behind your own cannons, which is really cool. Again, I, I love the cannon and laser cannon placement. I really can't say it enough. It's it's a great map to play on. Dude, I got him again. You might have to let the laser cannon fire once every turn, like after each player, but it only damages one player per shot. So on my turn, it hits my units. On Ephraim's turn, it goes again, but it hits Ephraim's turn units. I think that's the only way you can really balance the laser cannon for competitive play, just like the cannons work. I think that would be good, actually. I'm. This is one of my favorite maps so far. I love it. It's great. It's a really good map. Oh yeah, me playing with animations off is also a good thing for Ephraim because it means I can't see his units' HP. But. Considering I'm playing Hawk, I think that's only fair. He's playing two tiers below me. Although I will say, this might be a Sonya tier 2 map. Like, if this map was on a Monstrous by Web, I would probably say Sonya... Maybe not tier 2, maybe like high tier 3. This is a good Sonya map, for sure. Tons of forests everywhere. How do I get rid of that stupid research emote button that's covering my chat text? Can't even read the last... I don't know what you're talking about. 
Mike's, Mike's making excuses for how he's gonna lose the match. Ah, uh, he's fucked when the Black Storm comes in, my man. Global damage is so good. Oh wow, three, four tanks? Okay, he's really pumping the tanks down in the bottom right. Okay, all right. He's pumping the tanks pretty hard, look at that. Well, you know what he just says? Three tanks, build a medium tank, that's the rule. Oh, his own tanks are gonna get hit. Yeah. Oh my god, Ephraim, you gotta be more careful about the cannons, man. Ephraim's pretty good. He Ephraim keeps saying he's bad at advanced wars, but Ephraim's actually pretty solid. He could e he could easily reach like a thousand MMR in the Monster Spy Web if you bother to play competitively. Yeah, he, he he the reason he didn't attack the tank was because his artillery was on a base. So he didn't want to attack. He would have he would have base locked himself. He's building a lot of uh, a lot of tanks though. I kinda want Sonic to win because I like her snarky win quote. We'll see about that. We'll see. Boom ba 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 what does MMR stands for? Rating. Matchmaking rating. It's the same ELO system that they use in chess. So you gain points when you win, you lose points when you lose. And certain benchmarks are considered like... In advanced wars, I'd say you're probably like a Grandmaster once you reach 1400 MMR. That's like that Grandmaster benchmark. So he's probably... There's probably no point in me trying to capture the city unless I can back it up with a tank or two. What kind of terrain is over here? Is this uh, some mountain? I might move on to that mountain. See what I can see. All right, so this is a little scary. I have to back off here. Uh, this is too hot for me. I'm gonna have to do a little base skipperino again here. I don't know if he has any units over here. I think I'm gonna send one tank over here to try and interrupt this. Oh, hi there, Ephraim. How you doing? Placing your infantry in laser cannon range. That's bold. Alright. He's. It seems like he's focusing most of his attention. Mm, anything here? No? Seems like he's focusing mo most of his attention in the bottom, uh, bottom right. Okay, you stay put, you just do your scouting thing. You can stay and heal. And then we'll get another infantry over here. Sonia so hot in this game? I think they tuned down her hotness and made her more like cutesy. Advanced Wars 2 Sonia is most beautiful Sonia, in my humble opinion. Oh wow, Ephraim, you keep keep taking damage on your tanks, dude. Oh, he's attacking the laser cannon. Awesome. Oh my god, that opens up a path in the middle too. Look at that. There's like a bridge. Oh wow, that means you can attack through the center now. Whether the map passage can use in custom maps, can we see Manx play against someone on a volcano map? Yes, yes. If you go check out my last stream, I did a caustic finale match on a volcano map. It was super fun. I I really enjoyed the volcano. I I know, right? Things you never thought you heard me say. I really had a lot of fun with that match. It was super fun. The volcano added a tempo to the match. It meant you couldn't capture certain buildings on certain turns. You have to be super careful. Yes, when units are damaged, smoke comes out of them. It's a nice detail, actually. Yeah, the only problem is the volcano has a super slow animation. Like a mega slow animation. Mm 
No, you can't speed it up, sadly. It's, you can't speed up anything in multiplayer matches. Yeah, you gotta be careful. You, you could get HQ capped once the laser cannon goes down. Well, I appreciate that, Ephraim. I'm gonna... I'm gonna start building A units then. Oh, hi there. Got some tanks. You gotta be careful, though. You might He might lose... Uh, he has a lot of unguarded properties up in the top, if you see that. Oh, he built a tank. Smart. Pretty smart. Yeah, I'm finally getting the airport. Woo! Would Sna Sami have some snake? Oh, Sami would be broken on this map. Sami in mixed base? Oh my goodness. Sami would be absolutely broken on this map. It wouldn't even be a contest. Like, you see, you see how good infantry are on this map. Yeah, I would not want to play against Sami on this map. Oh, looks like we got rain. Looks like we got rain. I'm gonna put my artillery. Oh shit, my artillery can hardly move now. What the fuck? Alright, so I did get attacked here. I'm gonna do a join cap, though, just for fun. Boom. And then we're gonna do a little bit of a cheeky maneuver right here. Oh, hi there. A little infantry hiding. Oh shit, I got trapped again. Fucking rain! Fucking rain! Oh my god, this rain! Oh, this fucking rain is horrible. It looks like he's moving elsewhere now. Oh, another tank. Let's go. Alright, another tank here. I don't know where... I don't know where he wants to attack me next. We'll see. But we're currently tied 18 to 18 properties. Mang's turn to get cannon. Wait, am I gonna get cannon? Oh shit, I am, I think. Maybe? No, I'm not gonna get cannon, am I? Oh shit, I did get cannon. Yeah, someone. Ephraim, please kill the cannons. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm gonna... I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen, while he takes his turn. Is my BRB still visible? Let me check. Is it? Huh? Wait a minute. Uh, center place... Oh, no, here, here it is. Lovely. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen.
Tell me everything that happened. What did Ephraim do? What did he do? Oh shit, he destroyed the cannon. Crap. Look at that. Oh, he popped, oh, he popped counter break. Nice. So that means I can't attack him this turn. I shouldn't attack him this turn. Ooh, the flute is nice. He's attacking the cannon too? Okay. Well, I don't I don't mind that. The cannons have been incredibly annoying, so. Yeah, he can he can counteract the line of sight this turn. He can, you're right. Oof. Kinda scary. Sonya is basically the same character as Erika Flueda? What? Who's that? Is your shirt red or brown? Dude, I'm colorblind. Don't ask me. Don't ask me about colors. I can't answer such questions, my my friend. You can't ask me something like that. That's rude. Manx, what should I change about my Hawk remix to make it better? I'm not a musician, man. You gotta ask someone with more with knowledge. I just I didn't. There were certain parts of it that just sounded off to me. That's all I can say, really. Andy, what's an airport? Mangs, what's the color? I don't know what a color is. What's your favorite laxative? Best question. Pepsi Max, of course. Alright. I feel better now, the rain has gone. Okay. Black Storms should come in on a turn or two. Let's go for the, uh... Airports. Yeah, so we can't really attack him this turn. We can, but it's it's not a very good idea. It's not a very good idea at all. Oh, hi there. I guess I can attack him here, can't I? Yeah, you're not getting that airport, buddy. Yeah, remember that one time you interrupted my cap? Payback's a bitch, isn't it? Oh, hi there. That's a lot of units. He's coming with a lot of tanks. Oh, he's coming through the center. He's coming through the center, guys. Nice. He's coming through the center. Ow, I keep forgetting counter break exists. Well, I guess I could still attack here. Counter break isn't really that scary. You just gotta remember to stop attacking Sonya the turn it's up, and you should be fine. Look at how many units he's coming with in the center here. The problem is, I'm on a forest, so he's gonna get himself trapped. Oh, he did a join cap, did he? Yeah, that's cute. But look, I'm base locking him now. My RT is base locking him. Yeah, I made a mech, yeah. He has a tank up there that I have no response to. So I figured I'd build a mech. STOP INTERRUPTING MY AIRPORT! God damn it, Ephraim! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he saw- 
Oh, he scouted with the infantry. That's smart. That's actually smart. Oh, and now he has artillery in the center, too. Ooh, I like this play. It's cute, though. But once my Black Storm comes in, I'm just going to wreck him. This is a great map. I love this map. Da -da 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 -da. You will never learn what an airport is. Some things aren't meant to be learned, my friend. Some things just aren't meant to be learned. Yeah, I say it's attacking me pretty heavily in the center here, but... Again, I have his I have his bottom base on lockdown, which is very bad news for him. He's also not gonna get his airport, I think. This is a use all these maps are user made, yeah. All of them. We gotta take a look at the kill death uh, ratio here to see how it's really going. Do they sell Bang Energy in Norway? I never saw any. Uh, rarely. It's hard to find. Uh, you gotta go to Sweden most of the time if you wanna get it. I'm not a big fan of Bang, I'm gonna be completely honest. I think it's pretty overrated. Monster is like the best energy drink. There's a new monster called Mo M Monster Pink, which is sugar-free, and it's so fucking good. Ultra Pink. It's so fucking good, I can't believe that shit is sugar-free. Sweeten is part of NATO laughs, yeah. Jokes on them. Oh, Monster- Monster is the best energy, there's- there's no competition. Normally, you drink energy because of the caffeine in that. Monster, I legit drink for the taste. They could have no caffeine and I would still drink them. Sugar free, 50% aspartame. I don't give a shit. Mango Loco is pretty good. Yeah, actually. Alright, Black Storm. Could maybe get it this turn? If we if we take a lot of engagements, we could maybe get it. Okay, I think I might need to move my um Yeah, I need to need to move down here. But I need to uh, make myself a little smaller. There we go. Right, I need to see what I'm doing here. Um uh, I maybe I will get it. Okay, so what do we have here? We have a tank. Uh, but it's injured. I think if we can take a lot of engagements, we can get Black Storm this turn. Maybe. Maybe. Very close to getting it. I think we can probably get it. I kind of want to go, go away here. Oh shit. Oh crap. I gotta I gotta fight these guys first. Come on. Give me the black storm. Yes. I must commend you. Black Storm. Ooh, that's a good Black Storm. Oh, that's a good Black Storm. That's a good Black Storm. Ooh. Oh, that feels good.
Here we go. Yeah, this is this is bad for Sonya. This is bad for Sonya. We could maybe build a medium chunk down here. Or maybe we just continue pumping uh, pump pumping regular tanks, honestly. Oh, nice. Oh, no, there's an artillery there. We almost got it. We almost got it. Yeah, that was a nasty turn for Sonya right there, even though he's ahead of capture. That's a tough black storm, and now his base is in tatters. I think I think attacking through the center is a bit of a mistake here. Oh, wait, am I the one? Uh, am I the one ahead in capture? Oh man, maybe I am. Oh yeah, I am. Never mind. I, yeah, he's fucked. Oh yeah, he's completely fucked. I thought he was ahead, but no, he's not. Uh, yeah, there are French voices, there are Dutch voices, there are German voices, but uh, and there are English, obviously. But no, 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 Norwegian, no, no, Norwegians never get dubs. Are you crazy? Yeah, Ephraim lost a lot of valuable tempo building artillery to shoot the laser. I, I really think it's tough to, to kill that laser, man. You lose out on so much tempo doing it. I mean, played well, but overall, like, what are you gonna do against global damage, man? Where's the Lin Body Pillow? Haha! -ha. Must be fun asking that for the 50,000th time, 50, time. Can we speak Spanish for a moment? Si, si. Habla español. Como estas? Uh, loco, loco. Yeah, try playing on a normal map next time. Ephraim, it's fun. What are you talking about? What are you talking about, Ephraim? Hey, this is this map is great. It's hablo, hablo español, hablo español. Si, 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 señor. To be fair, you're from... Oh, okay. <laughs> that was too easy. <laughs> that was too easy! <laughs> Laser cannon victory? Alright, so... Alright, so for my next trick... My green screen is acting up a little bit. I gotta fix, fix that. So for this one, we're we gonna do a meme review. We're gonna do a meme review, and then uh, what I wanna do actually is uh, I wanna do Olaf versus Sturm in Permus now. That's right, Olaf versus Sturm in Permus. Now I play Olaf. My challenger plays Sturm. It's Permus now. I'm gonna show you just how powerful. I'm gonna show you how powerful Olaf is in Permus now. All right, let's get some memes. I can hear a bunch of people sending me maps. Ooh, we got- oh! We got Advanced Force fan art, nice! Alright. Oh, wow! Oh, wow! I, I love these, uh, what were they called? Yunakas? No. You 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 talk us? You 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 caught us. You caught us. Uh, 
Aww. Kimonos, I mean. Yeah, kimonos. Yeah, you caught us. Aww, look, she's been fixed. Hey, cute. Super cute. What the hell? Ah! Ah! So fucking... Oh, she's wearing thigh-high socks underneath. This is like... This art was made for me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alternate alternate skin now when? When? Alternate... You not, you, 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 you talk us fucking kimono skin now when? Wow, playing your engage? That's pretty cringe. Oh, nice. Lash looks even more daddy issues now. So fast. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What is this? Oh, and here are all the girls together. This art is so gorgeous. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's honestly amazing how beautiful women become in kimonos, despite the fact that they're, like, completely covered up. It's probably one of the, like, I, I know I sound like a weeb right now, but it's one of the most beautiful things women can wear, in my opinion. Advanced for CEO's method of protecting tanks be like Sturm and the Grim. <laughs> What's the color airport again? What's the color again? Okay, so this is the challenge. You play Sturm, I play Olaf. Perma Snow. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see who wins. Who wants to challenge me? Who wants to challenge me? You gotta say your actual name, though. Menskun, okay. See, where are you, Menskun? I can't see you. Oh, there he is. He was all the way at the top. Alright, so what map should we select for this? Bit of a simpler one, I'd say. Uh, 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 hmm. Maybe this one? Oh god, look at this one. Road to Glory, oh my goodness. Kirby land. Ooh, we could go harsh truth. That might be fun. Let's try harsh. Did did we do that one last time? That was the one I fought Storm on last time, wasn't it? Uh, maybe we should pick a different one then. Uh we could do caustic for now, honestly. It'd be, it'd be cool to see. Yeah, okay. We're, let's do caustic for now. Let's do caustic for now. All right, I play Olaf. Wonderful. <laughs> you play Sturm. <laughs> Weather is permanent snow. You gotta do a match on IGN Island one time. Oh, by the way, Maniskin, if you don't play fast, don't... 
again, I'm gonna say this once again, like, this is the final match of the night, most likely. If you play like my grandmother, I'm gonna leave and play against someone else. I'm sorry, I just, I know I'm very, I know I'm very, like, I'm very rude towards slow playing people, but I just, I don't want to sit through a match with a guy playing like a fucking granny. Just, just play snappy. I want to play fast. I wish there was a timer I could enable, that'd be so nice. Good, Star Flash style. Good, good, good. Please. Okay. So, I'm gonna ask you guys, actually. Who do you think will win? Who will win? Sturm or Olaf? I'm curious, actually. Let's, let's do a vote. Oh boy, it's so bright! God, such a white map, holy shit. My eyes, it's very bright, isn't it? Holy shit. <laughs> look, at, look at his capture face, it's so bad. <laughs> look at it. <laughs> Look at his capture face! It's so bad. Like, what can he do? Look, look at this shit! <laughs> he got rid of his properties! <laughs> I can't read his properties! Oh, this is so funny. Oh my goodness. Hey, what the fuck is he supposed to do? Mech spam to capture? Well, mechs are slow too, though. Kind of. <laughs> Oh my goodness. He's just now starting to cap his faces, guys. Alright, well, don't mind if I gobble up a couple extra properties. And this is before even the global damage comes in, guys. This is before the global damage even becomes a factor. Uh, let's have some fun with him, shall we? Let's build some recons. This looks unbalanced. I'm telling you, Olaf Permasnow is the best CEO in the game. I don't think there's any solitary CEO that can stand up to him. It's a bit map dependent. I mean, there are some roads on Caustic, I guess. <laughs> this is so rigged. Yeah, it kind of is. Alright, let's go. I'm still, like, kind of thinking about the volcano when I play. Alright, let's send the recon in. What's he gonna do? He can't stop it. Let's build, uh, let's build an artillery. <laughs> we need Rain Olaf versus Clone Andy. Ooh. That would go to Clawlandia, I think. Olaf is pretty shit in Permarain. Well, at least he's getting some properties now, which is nice. Build missiles to flex. I think I could build missiles and still win.
Hachi mech spam might be able to beat Perma Snow? Maybe. No, I don't think so. Uh, when I played against Hachi on a once worse by web... Oh, wait, can he actually reach me? Ah, oh, shit, he can. Uh, okay, that plan kind of backfired a little bit. But you know what? I don't give a shit. Because I'm going to have so much more money than him. It's kind of okay. Let's build a tank. He can't interrupt here either. No, he cannot. I'm gonna have so much more money than him. It won't. It won't matter. Like my economy will be so good compared to his. We can send the artillery down here as well. A skilled jugger can beat any stir. Oh, never mind. It was a recon he sent. I thought he built a tank. Wow. I guess some things never change, eh? I'm gonna have so much more money, Colin fans be like, yeah. Can, re can Storm Recons go through Snow? He, he, he pays the same as every other CEO, so he pays, uh, he pays three movement costs. True Snow, true, true Forests. How good is Jugger with perfect luck? He'd be unbeatable. Jugger with max luck would be unbeatable. There's no doubt in my mind that, that yeah, he would, he would be. Alright, this hurts a little bit. We have to do this. Ugh. But it's worth it because he takes so much longer to reinforce here compared to us. So it's, it's definitely worth it to sack some units into his for sure. Do 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 Hell, I'd say it is probably worth it to do this. So, very good. Let's go get this one as well. Why doesn't it say... Okay, it doesn't... Did I... Oh, I didn't, I didn't put capture on. That's why it doesn't display properties. Ah. Okay, but I have 16 properties to his 10. <laughs> poor guy, poor Sturm. This is why Sturm hired Olaf into Blue Moon, guys. Because Olaf beat the shit out of him in purpose, no? It's still very hard to interrupt this caps, though, with that 20% extra defense. Look at that. This infantry still hit very hard. Sturm is feeling a bit under the weather. And he still has Meteor Strike. That's worth noting. He still has Meteor Strike. He can't move through mountains at all. He can't move through mountains at all. Oh, really? You're gonna go for my recon? Okay. Interesting. Combi versus Sturm in Mega Snow. Yeah, that's the in Perma Snow. That sounds kind of boring, not gonna lie. Okay. Well, I kind of want this property. Sorry. There we go. Uh, I need to see what's 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 over down here. Just an infantry. I guess I can still go and capture this. My goodness. Attacking Sturm's infantry like this is does not feel good, not gonna lie. It doesn't feel good at all. Oof, that mech, though. I'm not a big fan of that. But, someone's gotta do it. Someone's gotta take the fall. Five HP of damage against the recon. My goodness. 
Day-to-day -day defense is so fucking disgusting. But look at the look at the money I have. I mean, compared to him, it's disgusting. Just my recons can wreck him. Mangs, will you title this stream Sturm Hates the Cold? <laughs> like you did with the Hawk and the Monster Spire? Yeah, that'd be a cool thumbnail, honestly. I think I would enjoy that. Oh, cheeky Sturm. Cheeky Sturm. Sturm did today's 2 OP, yeah. Especially the perfect movement. Just the 2020 would already make him one of the best CLs in the game, but the perfect movement on top of that is just insane. Yeah, you see how good he is. You see how strong his infantry are. I really don't want to brawl with him like this, honestly, but since because of the snow, I'm just able to get so many more first hits compared to him, so it kind of works out in the end anyway. Look at that, his infantry moves one. His team is good though, they nailed Sturm's team. the building now more mechs okay i guess mechs are not a terrible i guess i can see why he goes for mechs okay here i gotta be a little bit careful one two three four five six yeah i gotta be careful so his tank doesn't strike this is the just this is a very good area for him to fight in because it has a lot of roads which is something that he definitely likes Let's see can his tank reach me yes it can actually it's fucking kirby's in front kirby go away Oh my goodness. Did he pay? Okay, so he didn't place any units over down here, which is good. Okay, this is a little scary. We have to. We don't want to just let him walk over us here. Gotta head back to rest and recover a little bit. Okay, so his his mechs, yeah, his mechs can travel through the snow. So there, I can see why he's building them. There, they might be one of his best bets here, actually. But man, is this a tough battle for him to fight? A very tough battle for him to fight. You can stay there, protect the city. Mix heat soul, that's good in the world. I don't like it when Kirby's blocking the units. I see no missiles. Do you think I should build a missile just to flex on him? I can do it. I think I got this. I don't think you can win. The guy lost when he accepted the match. Yeah, probably did. Take all the properties. Sadly, I didn't enable capture victory, otherwise I might have won already. Alright, he's mech spamming. He's mech spamming. Oh, okay, he's interrupting my cap now. Gotta be careful. And of course, once my Winter Furry comes in, it's gonna be even worse to be him. Because all of his units are gonna take damage. Mang's bullying viewers in game and hates on Kirby. What a world we live in. You guys like to be bullied. I, I know you all watch Nagatoro. Even though you make fun of me for watching it, I know all of you watch Nagatoro. You love it when I bully you. You come into the stream to be bullied. Don't, don't act like you don't like it. Oh 
man, stop bullying me. <laughs> That's how you sound. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? We have a tank. Do. There we go. Place the artillery right here. Let's continue to have some fun, shall we? Let's go on to the base. Do, do. Oh my goodness, his mechs are so strong. Look at this shit. Yeah, you stay put for now. Do, 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 do. Yeah, season two is out. I haven't watched it yet. But I probably will soon. Do, 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 do. Recons are actually crazy good when uh, when they got so much mobility over the vehicles, they can really harass like crazy. Alright, I was supposed to build missiles. I need to do that next turn. You guys gotta remind me to build missiles next turn, okay? Oh! Chris, I missed your $50 donation! You are one epic egg. Thank you so much, Chris. Sorry for missing your donation. I was probably very focused on the game. But thanks a lot. I appreciate it. Ogmon donated five bucks. Hey, man, it's been a while. I'm currently doing a grim solo run on hard mode for dual strike. Wish me luck. Oh my god, that sounds horrible. That sounds horrible. But yeah, thank you, Chris. Thank you, Ogmon. Sorry for being... Sorry for being bad at reading donations. Okay, he's got, he's got mechs coming, guys. He's got mechs coming. Okay, Greta Thunberg. <laughs> uh, oh, what's going on over here? Okay, he can't attack me this turn. That's good. Grit of Thunberg, how dare you snipe attack me, sir? Okay, he's built a tank and infantry. I mean, the fact that he's still in the game should be a testament to how damn strong Sturm is. But uh, he's still. How are we doing on properties? Let's check the death right. Uh, let's, let's check the death uh, K to the kill to death ratio. And uh, once the Winter Fury comes in, though, it's gonna be tough for him. Let's see. So yeah, 22 properties to 30. <laughs> but we haven't actually. We we don't have we, like the K day the kill, the kill to death ratio actually isn't that bad. But man, that extra defense, man, it's so strong. It's so fucking strong. So freaking strong. But you know what's stronger? The ability to move through terrain without being slowed down. That's probably stronger. You know what's also strong? It's the ability to have a lot more money compared to your opponent. That's pretty strong. Do, 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 do. That's pretty strong. Alright, I was gonna build missiles this turn. There we go. Happy now, chat? go. Let's pull the recon back to get healed. Uh, what's going on over here? We have, uh, probably not a good idea to get hit by that, I think. There you go. I built missiles and caustic finale. Oh, he's mad now. He's like, how dare you build missiles, man? How dare you? 
build missiles for your power ranking? Sure, I'd love to. Bada bada bop, bada bada bop, boom doo 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 New objective break missile charm. <laughs> deny Manx any more content. No one can deny me the content. No one can deny me the content. He just doesn't have money. I have so many more units than him compared to. Like, I, I, my units are just so much better than his. The Meteor Strike might equalize it a little bit, but I can just spread out before the Meteor Strike comes. Should be very easy. Alright, he's pushing a little bit up in the up in the top here though. But I might I might be able to get Winter Fury this turn if I take a bunch of engagements. It'd be cool to get Winter Fury. Well, let's try let's try to get Winter Fury. Oh nice, nice artillery dipshit. Let's see, can we get Winter Fury? We're pretty close to being able to get it. If we can uh, blast our way through here somehow. I don't know if I can... No, I can't breach through here. There you go. That's how you do it. Can you withstand the cold? They already barely took damage, yeah. Winter Fury. When Sturm sits on properties, it's almost impossible to damage him. Yep. That's rough, buddy. That's rough, buddy. That is rough, buddy. Like I'm even pushing him to work to back towards his very own base. And I'm capturing this space from him now, too. So fucking good. So fucking good. Poor Stern, man. I feel sorry for him. Must be rough. I don't think he can withstand the cold, guys. I can build three tanks and an infantry every turn now. Three tanks and one infantry every turn. Oh, he's almost got his meteor strike, though. Almost. He almost has his meteor strike, guys. Almost. Manx, would you consider this remake a gem or coal? Um, it has a lot of love put into it. The visual aspects of it, I mean, like, the music and the CO animations are top-notch. But in terms of an, a remake, there it's very lacking. Doesn't have good online play, there are bugs, AI is kind of weak in a lot of the missions, graphics are not great. There's a lot they could have gone done differently with this one. An ability to toggle back to more classic-looking graphics would have been so good. And considering they delayed the game for two years, it's kind of insulting that they didn't have time to add this. 
so I both love and hate it. Again, I'm doing a full review of the game now. It's gonna be out maybe a week or so. I'm putting a lot of effort into it. So, um, but you'll, you'll see, you'll see. This game deserves a lot of praise, but it also deserves a lot of criticism at the same time. It's a very mixed bag. Um, it definitely should not have been sold for 60 bucks. If this game was like a 20 or $30 indie game, then I would have been a lot nicer on it. But the, the, the fact that they, do, they release it as a AAA, 60 bucks. What? Oh my god! That scared the shit out of me! I thought the snow vanished! That's interesting. So if you pop Blizzard or Winter Fury, it still plays the weather gets clear effect. Okay. That was unexpected. I did not expect that to happen. I did not expect that to happen at all. Holy shit. That's it. That that did not happen in the original. That did not happen in the original. All right, we're gonna get the missiles. Um, oh my god, I know exactly what to do. I'm gonna bait his meteor with missiles. <laughs> I'm gonna bait his meteor with missiles. There we go. <laughs> this is gonna be so funny, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bait this meteor with missiles. Missile Sean about to fulfill her purpose. That's what's happening here. In the days leading up to the release of the boot camp, I just emulated the first two games. I have to say I regret nothing. The originals are classics. They're amazing. Rip infantry, you did great. Oh, he's almost got his meteor strike. He might get it if he takes one more engagement. Maybe. But look at the attack I'm, I'm launching on his HQ right now. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna pop it. The meteor, by the way, raises his defense up to 60% or 50%. It's really broken. Is he gonna pop it, though? Maybe he's saving it? No, he's popping it. He's popping it. Is all you have left. Please don't break the game. <laughs> Thank you, Missile Chan. Very cool. <laughs> Get fucked, Sturm. <laughs> Yeah, you can't win this. <laughs> You're absolutely fucked, Minskin. Like, you, there is, there is no. Yeah, you cannot, you cannot win this. <laughs> it's again, Olaf Permasnow is the strongest CEO in the game. I, I don't think, I don't think Advanced Wars Max can stand up to him. I don't think High Funds Colin can stand up to him. It just, you're just fucked. You're just fucked. Like, what are you supposed to do against this? Do -do 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 -do. And now what I'll do is I'll just not attack you for a turn. I can also just run away from your other units. I can just let you attack me here. I can just focus all of my attention on your HQ, which I think is definitely... Ooh. I know what I'm doing. Mm -mm -mm. I'll just overwhelm you with a sea of units. Da, da, 
Yeah, just hang around here. Chill out, have some fun. I just have so many more units than him now, it's absolutely ridiculous. And that's it. That's how we win. Magnus must have bases too. What is he gonna do? He won't be able to catch up with me. He'll still be able to interrupt it, of course. But that's okay. He's still in a heap of trouble. <laughs> Doesn't even die on the counter-attack. Yeah, Mech's not gonna... <laughs> he has 2,000 money left. Mech's not gonna save you now, buddy. Mech's doesn't need Fire Emblem. I'm not done with playing Fire Emblem on the channel, but... We're enjoying a bit of a Advanced Force Renaissance right now, and I'm having fun with it. I will go back to creating Fire Emblem content at some point, especially when Andaran Saga comes out. You'll see a lot of Fire Emblem on the channel. And also keep in mind, we have that Genealogy of the Holy War remake coming, which is probably credible. That's gonna be huge. Oh my goodness. Ha <laughs> ha! Battleship! Let's go! He killed my missile? What a monster! How could you do such a thing? What a brutal monster you are. I'll just continue to build battleships, lol. <laughs> I think I can build one every turn with this economy. He'll just get swamped with indirect fire. I guess if he can get a meteor strike, it could be pretty devastating, but I, I, I don't think he's gonna get another one. I would be very surprised if he got another meteor strike at this point. Yeah, you're not getting through here. You're not getting any more properties. You got five days left, six days left, I mean. Submarine mangs just in case. <laughs> oh no, he has to base lock himself with the artillery. Horrible. He has to base lock himself with the artillery. Poor star. Yeah, that's not gonna work, buddy. And a cruiser, you never know. Yeah, it's true, you never know. Maybe I'll need one. He's trying, bless his heart. But his units just move too slow. Yes, exactly, uh, Phosphorus. The same person who leaked Engage leaked FE4. So that FE4 remake was in development. And of course, this person could be lying or misinformed, but if they got engaged right, there's a very good shot that they have some kind of inside source. So that doesn't mean we'll get an FE4 remake, but it means that it's this this leaker is a lot more credible than other leakers. Oh shit, wait, uh I was gonna shoot with a battleship this turn, oops. Ah, it's okay. There we go. That's where it belongs. It is kind of hard to dislodge Sturm from this particular position here. Because, again, he still has a crap ton of, like, defense. But I will continue to just get more and more battleships. So, 
And then there's five days left, so... I think you can resign if you want to, but this is the final game of the night, so if you want to fight on, then by all means, fight on. I think maybe he want to try and get a... see if he can equalize it with another Meteor Strike. I don't think he will, but he's welcome to try. Do 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 do. And we have oh we have this tank. Is this a tank? Yeah. Okay. So let's attack here. Why not? Ba -ba -da. I just want to survive till the end. Oh, 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 you're trying to not get routed. I don't think I'll be able to route you in six days, because you're still Sturm. You still have crazy defense. So, I really don't think I'll be able to route you in six days. Or in four days. That would, uh, that would be very difficult, I think. Maybe with Winter Fury I could try, but you still have infantry all over the map, so... That would be tricky. I'm not trying... I'm, I'm trying to go for your HQ, though. But again, with 20% extra defense, it's actually really hard to attack Sturm on his HQ. Oh wow, look at that. Moral victory, try not to get routed. Yeah, I can I can see that. I can see that. The Winter Fury will be brutal though. I think I'm, maybe I'll get it this turn, I'm not sure, we'll see. Uh, oh, I'll definitely get it this turn. Oh, definitely, 100% I'll get it this turn. So, let's start, look at that, 28 damage, I mean, that is just disgusting. That is just disgusting. Let the winds of war... Olaf's revenge for toy box, yeah. Winter Fury! This map needs an airport? No, 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 no. Caustic Finale does not need airports. It, I think airports would kind of ruin Caustic Finale. This is the best map I've ever created. The, the, I love this map. It is. I never have a boring game on Caustic Finale, ever. Mm. I think routing him in four days would. It's next to impossible. Since he can just keep spamming out infantry units. That being said... I am getting more and more battleships. And the global damage is nice. I don't know, maybe I can do it. It'll be a nice challenge, I guess. Especially with this beautiful missile joining the attack now. So, how much income do I have right now? I have uh, 25,000. So, I will actually be able to get another battleship next turn. So that'll be three battleships. I might be able to grab his HQ in four days. That would be that would be really funny, actually. I should try. I'm gonna try and get him in four days. It's gonna be tough, but uh Problem is my my own massive units is kinda working against me here. Let's see if I can do it. With three battleships, it might be possible. Maybe. I just need to capture his HQ. It's gonna be tough, but I might be able to do it. Yes, combine units together. Make it easier for me to route you. Probably more those two infantry down in the corner. I might need to send someone to kill them, but I think an HQ cap is probably the best thing I can do right now. Okay, 
Okay, that artillery is almost dead. Honestly, I probably should have built some Neo tanks if I want to punch through this. That would probably be the best decision, I think. It's gotta be hard to cap that HQ, man. That defense is just too damn strong. He can just target fire my infantry and build more mechs. Maybe if I focus fire with my battleships on his base, maybe I can actually just go capture it. That could work. He's still not resigning. He's gonna try and hold out. I'm gonna see if I can... I don't think I'll be able to do it, man. I think... I think... I really don't think I'll be able to do it. He just has too many units around this HQ area, and the uh, defense he gets a Sturm is just too fucking broken. Yeah, ro routing him is too hard. I mean, Skill, you can resign now. You, 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 I'm not able to route you until day 20. Like, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do it. So you, you fought well. I'm still going to win the match, but I'm not, I'm not going to be able to kill you. Salute to the Sturm. You fought well, all things considered, but one does not simply beat Olaf in Permus now. Alright, let's go download some memes while this guy's playing. Moral victory achieved. Can he get the meteor? Not if I don't attack him. I I don't I do I don't think he can get the meteor now. Keep, keep in mind he has the twenty percent fatigue now, and that really you really feel that stir, because his power bar is so fucking big. Okay, just just to be a little nice, I'll help you get the. I'll help you get the. Uh, I'm not even gonna see what I'm attacking here. I'm just gonna do this. There you go. Maybe I'll get your meteor now. I don't know. Let's see. You're not gonna get it. <laughs> you're not getting. You're not getting three stars worth of power in one turn. You're just not. <laughs> one damage on the tank on the HQ. Yeah, he has 60% extra defense. Keep that in mind. 40% from the HQ. 20% from his day to day. It's disgusting. Yeah, I'm not gonna get the meteor. Sorry, buddy. No second meteor for you. Alright, well, that was fun. It went as I expected. No one can stand up to Perma Snow Olo. We are victorious! Hey, yo. Thanks for the matches, ladies and gentlemen. That was fun. It is decided. This is the strongest CEO in the game. Olaf Permasnow, best CEO in the game. No one can touch him. No one can touch him. Only like Drake and Permarain, but then he wouldn't be Permasnow anymore. Okay. Let's do a quick Q&A before I log off. Unless it's dual strike. Yes, unless it's dual strike. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh, May Mace. Alright, fine. Sorry about the May Mace. Bought the game just to support the series, end up being hooked again. Who would have guessed re-releasing re re 10-10 out of games with some improvement would feel this good? Yep. It's it's an easy win. 
<laughs> I'm too weak. All of Inferno Snow. Unlimited power. Oh, that was the old one. Not that I mind showing it again. You build missiles to flex. I build missiles because I know how to use them. We are not the same. That's amazing. That's amazing. What's this? Darkest dungeon style Lin from Oh Is this AI? I think this is AI art, right? Okay, that's actually really good though. What the fuck? That's actually really good, though. What the fuck? Wow, real artists in shambles right now. Alright, now we can do the Q&A. AI art looks a little off, but it'll just continue to improve. So At some point, you won't be able to tell it apart anymore. Uh, Bob the Minion asks, wrong game, but would you do a Smash or Pass Fire Emblem Edition? Um, I, I've done I've done Smash games before. I can do them again. I'm not very good at Smash, though. Smash is fun for 20 minutes for me. That That's the amount of time I can play Smash before I get bored of it. it. It's very fun for 20 minutes, and then I have no desire to play it again for six months. That's my relationship with Smash. And whenever I, um... And whenever I, um... Oh. Oh, oh, you... What? what? What did he ask me? Smash or pass? What? Oh! Oh, wait, what? Smash or pass? Okay, explain this to me. What? How does this game work? I'm not degenerate enough to play along with these six games. What smash and pass is like... Oh, you mean like, who would I sleep with and ditch? No one. Because that's degenerate behavior. Don't sleep with a girl you don't want to put a ring on. That's bad, bad news. Take it from someone who's been involved with uh, quite a few toxic girls. Don't do it. Don't do it. It leads to bad places. And eventually your life's gonna get ruined. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Find one girl, put a ring on her finger and be with her. Don't smash and pass. No one night stands. Don't do casual sex. Trust me, it's not worth it. And this is not this is not just me being a boring like dad. This is genuine life experience from someone who's been down that road and burned himself hard. It's a, it's it's a life of misery and 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 horrendousness. Don't smash and pass anyone. Sonic Samurai asks, favorite male CO? Ooh, my favorite male CO. I have to say Olaf, honestly. I really like him. But Drake is a close second for me. I like both the weather COs. Olaf and Drake are both amazing. I like playing them. I like their designs. I love their music. I like global damage. So Olaf and Drake, pretty much the, the chunky boys are the, are the best for me. Uh, Brandon Williams says, will you use that cute fan art in the thumbnail? Yes, but I need to ensure that the person who sent it is the artist, otherwise I might have to ask him. I never put art in thumbnails. I never put fan art in my thumbnails without asking for the artist's permission. So, I need to fin find out who made them. Uh, Wyvern asks, can you organize a Smash Bros. Ultimate Tournament? So again, I'm not really a Smash YouTuber and I don't really find it all that fun. I don't really find it fun to spectate because I don't know enough about the game to find it entertaining. As I said, when it comes to Super Smash, I like playing it for 20 minutes and then I get bored. So for me to organize a Smash Tournament, I wouldn't have much fun with it. Uh, Alice asked Max, did you see the new Zelda game came out? I have, I think it looks like ass. Uh, it's probably fun to play. But I'm not really a Zelda YouTuber, so it doesn't really hold a lot of interest for me. Maybe though, we'll see. 
Uh, Exodus has more maps before the stream end. No, I'm tired. Sorry. Next turn. Next time. Uh, Saragon has the Darkest Dungeon Part 2 with Davis. Yeah, as soon as I get a little bit better at the game, I might do another stream at it. Uh, Suxita asks, Advanced Wars voice acting tier lists. I don't really like making tier lists. I think that they're very boring content. But I might, I mean, that doesn't mean I'll ever make one. It's just this, I don't want to do it often. It's just fucking boring. Uh, here's my opinions. This goes into B rank. This goes into C rank. Dang. Bethany asks, no question. Go back into the kitchen. Make me a sandwich. Are you actually blind? What? Alice, I asked I answered your question, like. Literally. You asked me about Zelda. I literally answered it like two minutes ago. Scroll back. Inkling asks, aren't you gonna play either WarioWare or Wario Land for the Wang Synergy? I've never played a Wario game. I I don't know what it is. I've never I mean I do know what it is, but I, I've never played a Wario game. I want to though. I like Wario, he's cool. Ah okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm done. Thank you so much for the stream. On Sunday, I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be playing a chess stream. I had a sudden itch to play chess again. So, if you want to challenge me on chess.com, we're going to do a we're going to do what I like to call fire emblem but without waifus. See you guys on Sunday. Bye-bye. <laughs>